What's going on, guys? This is Treaty Oak Revival, Cactus House Sessions. Here we go. Well, my trailer looks like a liquor store Or maybe one that just got robbed Well, I got every bottle you can think of Honey, from ground to a chanting rock And I ain't Keith Whitney and I ain't George Jones But I damn sure could be the next And my girlfriend had too much slipping last night I can't remember what I said But goddamn They say people are creatures of habit I got more habits than I need And I did drink and smoke And I dabble in the coke And I get the smoke and the weed And I don't care if I get cancer Or some disease and die today Because that's just about My only ticket out of Boom Town, the USA baby history in the making just know <laughs> all right this next song is a song I wrote uh, with a buddy of mine named Creed Carr and it's about women who cover up uh, stuff with tattoos especially flowers this one's called tattooed roses it goes like this Oh 
she thinks another drink will drown it out without a doubt and he thinks yeah. well there ain't enough ink in her arm to cover up the charm of a man if she won't in a week she probably won't it's had two roses they don't cover up the pain well they just So I can't really <laughs> yeah. see all of y'all. Good, man. But you want me to look it over here? Thank y'all for playing tonight. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for having us so much. We really for sure. It. Uh, so since uh, this is our first time meeting, uh, where are y'all from? Uh, we're all from. You want to do like a roll call? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. we can do I'm that. Uh, my name's uh, my name's Sam Canty. I'm lead vocals. I'm from uh, Harlingen, Texas, but I, I claim Odessa, Texas. I've lived there for like 15, 14 years now. Uh, you yeah. got it. Uh, my name's Lance Vanley. Uh, and I was born in Odessa, raised in Midland, been here pretty much my entire life. Uh, it's Andrew Carey on bass over here. Uh, you're from around here, right? Yeah. yeah. Living in Odessa, came here from Abilene. Came here from Abilene. This is Jeremiah Vanley. This is my uncle. Uh, he's also born and raised here in Odessa. This is Kelly McKay, our born drummer. In born in Amarillo, Texas. Life, life in Odessa. Life around Odessa, Texas. All right, mm -hmm. I like it. So, uh, how long have y'all been playing together? Uh, we've been together as Trudy Oak for about a year. Um, Andrew actually just recently started, yeah, he, he just uh, started playing with us. Uh, our previous bass player just had a lot going on in life. He had to step down from being able to play in the band. He is now our sound guy. And so, yeah, Andrew's been with us for about a month, but the rest of us have been playing together for about a year. Heck yeah, man. Well, thank you guys so much for playing tonight. Uh, I'm going to let y'all get back to the music. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Thank y'all. <laughs> Uh, 
this next song is a brand new song, so forgive us if it doesn't sound the best, but uh, I think it's a pretty decent one. So we'll go ahead. This one's called Miss Call. song is called Irish Goodbye. It's a song about an Irish goodbye is where you leave a bar and you don't tell your friends that you're leaving because you don't want to be there. I was trying to write a song about this with my buddy. This is what I came up with. <laughs> Step up. Sorry guys. My bad. Won't screw up again.
What have you been doing in my dreams? It's turning out to be a little nightmare when I sleep. But I got the upper hand. Cause I was gone before she ever really knew who I am. This bar stool's my escape. Things that I don't want to see. And if there is a going on guys sorry uh don't mean to throw you off um so since we've got to know each other a little bit uh, i thought i'd ask uh, these little questions um what do you uh what are influences for you guys making music you take this uh man i started writing music a while back in when i was in college as a hobby um i listen to everything and anything man uh, but uh i guess mainly when i'm doing my songwriting process it's mainly a lot of uh, rock and roll and country music, punk rock mainly. I do a lot of Blink-182, uh, like Texas Red Dirt, Randy Rogers, William Clark Green, uh, Cody West, Co Wetzel, all them guys. Uh, it's, it's, it's like a little mix of everything, man. It's just what's ever in my head at the moment is what I'm, what I'm writing. Heck yeah. Um, so uh, I know you are living through this pandemic as we all are. How has that changed uh, how y'all create music right oh now? Man, it's been really, really hard, man. Uh, we we kind of just we just kind of got Andrew as our bassist, <laughs> and Lance is Lance is a pretty kind of a, a newer member as well. But uh, this pandemic has affected us a lot, man, because we don't get to we don't get to do gigs like this. We don't get to perform for people, and that's that's our lifeblood, man. That's what we go off of. So um, it's been really tough. We haven't been able to practice a lot, so we just kind of recently have gotten back into the rhythm of things where we can work together fluently as a band. And that's why I, when, when, when Juan here asked me to come do this concert, 
it was like, man, it's kind of last minute, but I think we're there. We're almost there. So we we, we hope y'all are enjoying it, man, at home, and we we just we just enjoy what we do. So yeah, absolutely, it's definitely affected us for sure. Yeah. Are there are there any benefits of like y'all found that there's more time to actually like uh, get the, uh, when you are together to be more creative or more like there's a bigger flow going absolutely man i mean during this pandemic uh we've spent a lot of time by ourselves and obviously i've when when i'm by myself a lot of the times it, it it gives me time to think about stuff and i've i've started it actually has helped me write a lot more uh, i've just started writing more material and stuff but it just sucks so bad because you have all this material in your head that you want to get out but you can't you can't say what's up to your band and make it happen and start playing parts and all that stuff. So, but um, yeah, it definitely. The first practice we got back in, man, it, it felt so good. So, we just we're we're happy to at least stuff is lifting up a little bit and we can get back together and start working on new material and new sound. Hell yeah. Uh, yeah. What's uh? So you said you're working on new material. Is there anything next after I guess the foreseeable future for? after COVID or whatever. What's next, I guess, yeah. is the big question. <laughs> yeah, what's next? Uh, I'll take I'll take this Go one. Ahead, man. So yeah, what's next really for us is we're continuing to finish up writing these songs. And we've got a few more down the pipeline that aren't even going to be played tonight that we're getting ready to finish. And the next thing you know that we want to do is we want to get into a studio. We want to get an album recorded. We want to get it out there so people can hear it. Been hearing you on Facebook. Uh, <laughs> Boomtown, the first song we played, a lot of people have been uh, really wanting a re full recording of that, and so I hope with this, it's a you know, a little help tide you over a little bit uh, onto the next thing. And so yeah, just what's next, and then you know, once places start opening back up, places like Cactus House here, other venues around town, we want to start getting out and playing those venues, so you guys can come out and say what's up. Yeah, we hope you have us back, man. Hope we don't disappoint you too much. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> we we are definitely gonna have you guys back. Thank, Thank you. you so much for playing tonight. Absolutely, uh, I know y'all cool. got some a uh, few more, and then uh. I think I'm going to come in for another thing, but, hey, I'm going to let y'all get back to it. All right. Thank you so much. Okay. This next one's our second to last song. Uh, it's a song about one night stands that I wrote. This is called One Time Thing. Every single word that I said Maybe you 
was playing on play. Back to square one. I've been going to this bar for too damn long, and I ain't seen you long. I got it. Hey. <laughs> got a phone call. We, we got a phone call. Don't, he's not trying to be another missed call. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> sorry about that. You're good. We got distracted You're as an okay. uh, entire group. Um, I um, really appreciate y'all coming out and playing for us tonight um, and everybody at home uh, tuning in. Uh, where can everybody find your music right now? Uh, right now, we have a single out right now. It's called, it's, it's actually the next song we're going to play. Uh, it was a song that we recorded live at the Actor Theater. And it's called Ode to Bourbon. It's on Spotify, Apple Music, and all music platforms, SoundCloud, wherever. So, all right. And um, I know things are hard right now, but uh, what is the most direct way that uh, people at home can help y'all guys out? Y'all have merch or anything? Uh, well, me and Lance have been having a couple. Uh, one, we had one, our first acoustic live show, and I think we're going to be doing a few more acoustic live shows coming up. So, if y'all would please tune into those if you like the music and enjoy the band. And uh, we'll have a little Venmo tip jar. Uh, we also have merch. Uh, on, hit up our Facebook page. DM us on Facebook or Instagram. Uh, we have shirts, hoodies, decals, koozies, whatever you want, man. It's all for sale. And you can rep the band, man. So. Sure. Well, thank you so much for play, uh, playing tonight. Thank you guys for watching at home. Um, if you can, uh, if you got the means, donate to Cactus House. This keeps the live streams coming. They keep everything, the lights going, the lights on. Uh, you know, lights. You know how lights work. Um, <laughs> I don't got to tell y'all how lights work. But it keeps us going. Um, thank you so much. Um, Treaty Oak Revival. Thank Absolutely. you, guys. Thank you, guys. Hats off to thank Cactus, Cactus House, man. Appreciate it. Yeah. Thank y'all so much. It's been a good one, man. All right. This next song is a song I wrote. Uh, we lost a band manager a while back. And uh, we were all pretty low. And I wrote this song in memory of him. So uh, shouts out to Jim Schaefer. Uh, this next song is called Ode to Bourbon. <laughs>
Thank y'all so much, Cactus House. We're Treaty Oak Revival. We out of here.